Hey everybody, welcome back to Gray County Grillin'. I'm Chris, and today we are going to be smoking some bologna on the Traeger. If you've never had bologna smoked before, you simply have to give it a try. It is awesome. And once you've watched the video, then please check out my Amazon affiliate links in the description box down below, and also the link to my Patreon. I would absolutely love your support there. Let's get to it. And here is the bologna that we're going to be smoking on the Traeger today. So I've got two different chubs here. We're going to do them up each one differently. One is going to have the Traeger Summer Shandy rub. And the other is going to have Cabela's Open Season Maple Jalapeno Seasoning. So those are going to be good. First though, what you need to do is cut cross hatches. Just score the outside of the bologna and you're just going to do that all the way around. And then to bind our seasonings we're just going to use some plain old yellow mustard. And just try and force it down into those cross hatches as well. Just give it a good rub. And make sure you get it all over. And don't forget the ends. We're going to get some seasoning on those as well. Okay, I'm just going to wash my hands and then we'll get these seasoned up. And we'll get the first one with the Summer Shandy seasoning. This is my first time using this so I have no idea what it's going to be like. But you want to make sure you get all the way around each one of these bolognese. And it sounds like I got a big clump in there, so we'll open it up on the other side. All right, and that one, <laughs> that's coming out a little faster than we, we expect or we need, but that's good. And there we got a good amount of seasoning. And then we'll just do that to get the ends. There we go, that one is seasoned up nice. And then we'll hit up the other one with the Cabela's seasoning, the maple jalapeno. Yeah, this stuff's coming out really nicely. And then just like we did, we'll just get the ends in there and get them seasoned up good. All right, so we're gonna get the smoker started up and then get these on. And we've got the Traeger started up. We are just going to leave it on the smoke setting for this entire cook because the bologna is already cooked. We just wanna get some smoke rolling on it for about two, two and a half hours and that's it. So we're just waiting to see some smoke coming out of the grill. And then we'll know that uh, we can close the lid and get get it warmed up to about uh, 160, 170 is where it likes to settle in once uh, once it's ready to go on the smoke setting. And also, just a quick look here. Just going to be using the Amazing Pellet Smoker, and that is actually an interesting blend of pellets. I'm just going to grab the bag here. 
So this is what we're using, savory, savory herb. It's got oak wood, oregano, rosemary, and thyme. So that, I think, is going to add a very interesting flavor to our bologna. So we're just going to wait for this to get ready, wait for the Traeger to get ready. And actually, you can see we got the smoke rolling off of there already. So we'll shut the lid, wait for the temp to come up, and then these bolognis will be ready to go. Okay, we've got the pellet smoker going, and we've got the Traeger rolling with the smoke as well. So it's time to get these two bolognis on. So I'm going to try putting them on the top rack and we'll see how they take the smoke sitting on the top rack with the amazing pellet smoker right underneath. Hopefully that will add a really good smoke profile to those bologna chubs. We'll check back in a little bit. We are at just over an hour and a half on both of these bolognis. So let's open up the Traeger and take a quick look. Yeah. So we're kind of in the middle of a smoke cycle right now. Let's uh, get a little bit of a closer look at them, shall we? Well, there we go. You can see how they're starting to pull apart from the cross hatches. And they are starting to look pretty good. I think I'm gonna give it probably about another half an hour. And then I'm gonna put sauce on the one on the right hand side. That is the more savory one. And I think I'll leave the other one maybe no sauce. Uh, we'll see how I'm feeling in about half an hour, but these things are looking really good and I cannot wait to give them a try. We're now about two hours in on the cook with these two chubs of bologna and now it's time to get sauce on one of them we're going to leave the other one naked and just have the flavor of the rub and the smoked bologna by itself and as for sauce i'm just going to use some bullseye old west hickory nothing fancy but uh, the old west hickory is pretty darn good so that's what we're going to use on this bologna Okay, so we're gonna leave it like that for a little bit longer, maybe about a half an hour, and then we'll throw some sauce on just towards the end and just give it another awesome layer of flavor. Stick around. These bolognese are all done. It's been just over two and a half hours. And that is how they look. Fantastic. So we'll pull these off, take them inside, and give them a try. The bolognese are all done, so let's cut into the first one, and we'll take a look. It looks like bologna. Let's cut a little slice off though and give it a try. And that is very good. It kinda tastes like a hot dog. <laughs> and then here's the other one. It 
Oh, I think I like this, the second one even better. But both of them are pretty darn good. Well, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up and comment down below. Share it with your friends. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Have a nice time.